and welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be doing a slightly different video i feel like i always did a slightly different video somehow it turns out like all my other videos but today i'm gonna be um <clears throat> attempting to change my house from summer to fall i don't do i haven't done a whole lot of decorating you guys have seen my apartment tour and since then i really haven't changed much everything has pretty much been the same but i've been feeling a little bit inspired lately i've been wanting to do things different um you know change things up a bit i love the fall time it's like my favorite time of the year to decorate as far as weather not a fan of halloween thanksgiving is all right but i just love the fall time and the weather getting cooler and blah 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 whatever i live in the south so it's not really much of a fall anyway so i'm sorry if my washing machine is like doing the most back there but i'm gonna be going to different stores i'm gonna be trying to do this on the budget because honey right anybody got time to be spending a whole lot of money is i'm gonna be picking up small pieces that will make a difference but that won't pack a punch to my bank account so that's what i'm gonna do i am ready to go i feel like this is like shopping outfit like when you're shopping you need some big hoops t-shirt jeans and a hat so i am ready i'm gonna take you guys with me um yeah i might do some other stuff too you guys are just gonna have to come along and tell me why i want chick-fil-a every time i want chick-fil-a it's sundays guys before we can do anything we need to wash this car this car is so nasty right now so I'm gonna go give it a little bath and then we'll see about everything else later Right, guys so i just left joanne fabrics and crafts or whatever it's called um i spent i spent a little bit more than what i wanted i spent about i think about 40 dollars, but um i got a lot of beautiful 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 flowers but i feel like a lot of things that i got are going to really make a big difference so i'm hoping to still stay under 150 under 150 under 100 was the budget but now it's under 150 under 120 but we'll try to keep it within that so i will see you guys in a bit was a total bust uh did not find anything that i mean there was interesting things but not anything that i would like actually spend money on um so i'm gonna go ahead and put all my chips in home goods hopefully i can find everything else that i need in home goods and you really shouldn't do what i'm doing right now you really shouldn't try to find all your pieces in one day the only reason i'm doing that is because i already have a lot of pieces to work with so I just need to find some fill ins and I know those are like generic things so I know I can find them um, but when you decorate you really want to just take your time and buy like 
little pieces one at a time on your days off just going to random like targets or home goods or tj maxx's and just gonna take your time with it but you know i'm hard-headed so <sighs> fingers crossed that tj maxx or uh, home goods has everything that i need Ryan <laughs> I'm finally sitting down. I've got my tea going here. Let's get this video together so I can go eat because your girl's getting hangry. A degree and a master's. Bachelor's and a master's in rambling, but we're not doing that today. So we're gonna get into it. So I was able to spend a hundred and twelve dollars. So I want to start with what I got from Joanne Fabrics. So Joanne Fabrics, obviously they sell fabrics, but I usually go to Joanne Fabrics for their um, flowers they're fake artificial flowers um i do have one real flower that i keep in the house and it's this one right here behind me like i said i went to joann's they were having a huge sale it was like 70 percent off all their like fall flower arrangement and everything so i decided to pick up a few things i got a wreath usually all year round i use my like glitz and glam wreath it's always hanging on my um like on my door i use that all year round so this is the wreath that i got this came out to be 70 percent off now you're probably looking at it going like benji this is totally spring oh so i should tell you guys i'm not really like a orange and red and fall colors colors type of girl when i think of fall i think of blush <laughs> Actually, I think of blush with any season, but yeah, so it has a little bit of like the little pine cones, is that pine cones? Um, and then it has the flowers, it has the, like the flocked um, little things back there, and then it has the, obviously the wood uh, base on it. I just thought this was really pretty, really dandy. It said fall to me, um, and yeah, I really, really like it. It's not my usual sort of like cold, steel, glitz, glam. I was thinking of softening up a little bit, you know, doing something a little bit more fall appropriate, right? Because usually I just go right into like glitz and glam, silvers and gold. Um, next thing I got are gonna be smaller wreaths. I got these two small ones. Um, these came out to be like $2, I wanna say, $2 each. But I was thinking of using these in my trays. Um, I was thinking of putting these at the bottom um, in my, like my, you guys will see what I'm talking about, but I'm gonna be using them in the trays uh, on my table and then the one in my bedroom. And I'm gonna be putting this at the base of the, um, the vase where the flower is. And I thought this would just be really nice to give my trays like a fall, theme but still keep within my sort of blush-ish nude-ish type of colors all right the next things i got are just gonna be like a bunch of like flowers i went nuts with the flowers um these three are the same so we're gonna leave them together so these are like some really nice blush they're not like a light I hope this makes sense. So I feel like there's two types of blushes. There is spring blush, and then there is like fall fall blush, right? Fall and summer blush-ish type of colors. I feel like these are more a little bit more rust colored. They're a little bit, I hope you guys can see that. Let me see if I can come in a little bit closer. They're a little bit more rust colored. They're more like uh, a slightly deeper tone than just the regular blush. These have a little bit more of a salmon look to them. So I thought these would be great for fall time. I thought they would be super appropriate for that time. So I went ahead and picked those up. I don't know. This one is really not a fall blush. I feel like this one is just a regular blush. But I had this fantastic idea of buying this. This is like glitz glam gold like leaves. And I was thinking of let me see putting these two together so um having like a you guys will see but i have an idea for this i was thinking of making a bouquet with these two and i just thought you know the soft flower the rigidness of the metallic and the like 
I just thought it would be really nice. And this is going to go on my um, my tray that's in on my coffee table. The next one that I got is just a champagne sort of color. Um, it's like an off-white beige color. It's very basic. So I don't really know where I'm going to put these yet, to be honest. I know that I'm going to be making a bouquet for my bedroom tray. So I'm thinking of either doing this like rust color in the bedroom or I'm thinking of doing the pink in the bedroom and then this like orange really fall look right here behind me. Um, maybe and mixing it up with maybe some of these like um, off-white-ish flowers that I got and I also got another pink like dark pink maybe mixing those together and making like a beautiful like pink and rust this is probably the most fall color I got <laughs> completely but I love these I like how full that they are um, I think it's just pretty and perfect oh that actually makes a that actually makes a cute bouquet right there you can squish this on the inside like that move this around something like that I think would look really pretty I'm gonna add this pillow even though it doesn't count because I got this pillow a while back it's probably been a couple of weeks I got it on sale at Target when I was just in Target so we're just gonna count this in as something that I already had now I don't even know if I'm gonna be keeping this pillow because I don't know if it's gonna go with what I'm trying to do but we shall see so it's just a big a fluffy pillow I originally got it to go on my couch and I ended up putting it on my couch and it just overwhelmed my couch my couch is very small um, it fits me because I'm short but my couch is very small and I think a pillow this big just kind of overwhelms everything and it didn't work now I don't know what I'm gonna use it yet but I feel like I may want to keep it because this is like a 30 something dollar pillow and it was on sale for 15 so I might keep it just because it was such a great deal so before I get into home goods let me show you guys what I got from Michaels because it's just like a couple of things I also had a coupon with Michaels I had a um, 40% off a regular price item and I had a 25% off my total purchase which was amazing because they let me double dip with my coupon and yeah so I got this cute little um, ceramic pumpkin I wish this top part was more like a metal color like a gold or like a silver but it's just a regular brown color how am I painted I might not it's not that big of a deal next thing that I got is gonna be this candle right here I got this from Michaels and this was the one that was 40% off of a regular of a regular purchase um, so I it's just a basic fall candle I wanted something that really said fall on my tray so I decided to go with this I thought it looked really really nice let's move to home goods okay I only got a few things and I never seem to be able to go to home goods for like a new season like Whenever I'm decorating for a new season, I never, I'm never able to not buy a throw. Countdown, I have one, two, three, four, five throws right now, okay? And I use them <laughs> at all times. So I went ahead and saw this throw and I thought it was a really, really pretty. It's a soft blush pink throw with some tassels, some pink tassels on the bottom there. I thought this would look really nice. So I'm going to use this one of two ways. Either this is going to go on my couch or this is going to go in my bedroom. It's just going to depend on where it looks best. I'm thinking it might be a little bit of overkill in my bedroom just because I have sheets that are pink. Yes, I bought three sets of sheets that are all pink and I think sometimes that's weird because when I'm taking pictures from Instagram, I'm like, oh my god, I hope these people don't think that, like, I sleep, like, in the same sheets, like, year-round. <laughs> but I honestly, when I like something, I get a lot of it. So I got this pillow from Home Goods, And this pillow right here really spoke to me when I saw it. Because, first of all, I love the little tassels. It has tassels on all four corners of it. But the thing that really grabbed my attention was that this said fall but pink to me at the same time. I thought this would look so, so cute on my couch with the blush pillow that I already have on my couch. Mix those two together, I thought it would just be perfect. But I absolutely love this pillow and this was on sale for nine bucks. Can y'all believe that? Nine dollars and I know this pillow was expensive. Yeah, originally it's $58 and I got it for nine dollars, girl. 
so in my bedroom I have a carpet that's on the floor it is one of those uh, white like shaggy carpets but the car I've had that carpet for so long I think I've had that carpet for like four or five years now and I think it's starting to be like girl I'm at the end of my rope here I decided to go ahead and change it I was originally looking for a blush a blush carpet I was like come on Benji chill with the blush okay so I decided that I was gonna look for like a gray because for me it's if it's not blush it's got to be white or it's got to be gray those are the only colors that I really like F with like that so as I was browsing I saw this right it's like this really long gray like sort of like tapestry ish sort of carpet it's really long well not really long but it's quite wide as you can see it was not, I was like okay I really like this but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get it because it looks expensive it feels expensive I just feel like it would be really expensive and then I looked at it and it was $16.99 girl I now realize why it's 16 I think I saw it earlier yeah it's got a rip right in the middle here see at all when the carpet is down so I was like okay $16.99 for a great quality carpet I'm still gonna get it um, and you can't see the rip at all. This was literally the hardest decision that I had to make all day. I really wanted some new like um, placemats. I was I don't know what I was looking for for placemats, but then I saw these, and it was so. I'm sure you guys saw it from the video that I made earlier. But um, they had this, and then the other color I ended up going with this color just because I feel like this color would kind of work better with my decor even though i really 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 like the mustard yellow one but i feel like the mustard yellow one doesn't quite say fall and it won't quite work for what i'm going for and for the look that i want my place to have so i went ahead and went with this guy next thing that i got is this um napkins to go over over my oven so it says i i i'm guessing love fall but it says i leaf fall because it's, a, it's just a leaf there so, all right guys so that's pretty much it i'm gonna go ahead and go eat i hope you guys enjoyed this style of haul where i take you guys along and you guys kind of spend the day but not really with me but i thought this was kind of nice because um, it's a little different pace from how I usually do my decor hauls. So, yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know down below what you guys are going to be doing for the fall. Are you guys going to decorate? Are you guys like, girl, I'm not finna decorate for fall. Just so I can turn around and decorate for the holidays all over again. But, um, yeah, make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that whenever I upload a video, you don't miss it. Make sure you check out my website. Yes, that's right. Beautybybenji.com officially launched two weeks ago if you haven't been following me on instagram then you don't know but now you know uh, i launched my own website so i will leave the link down below so you guys can go check it out and see all the cool things that i have going on there so that's it bye guys and set the face using my sephora micro smooth powder i know i'm doing this in a weird order but i like to set my face with this powder after 